It's the end of the day with Ray. Hello, my friends. Okay, if you're 59 years old and you go to the doctor for your annual physical, and let's say that that annual physical got postponed by a decade, well, the doctor's probably going to tell you, Ray, we got to put you on the treadmill. We want you to do a stress test. We got to check out those veins. So here I am, I'm on the treadmill and the technician says, okay, we got to get your heartbeats up to 160 beats per minute. When we get to 160 beats per minute, we're going to get some fantastic data and we'll be able to see what's going on in those veins of yours. So it's all about data. That's fantastic. She sold me. So here I am, I'm on, the, I'm on that treadmill and I'm going, I got to be honest with you folks, when I got to 120, I was breaking out in a sweat thinking, holy crap, this is going to be tougher than I thought. I'm at 145 and the pain going through my legs is so intense, it's unbelievable. I feel like I'm a marathon man that's not supposed to be in a marathon. I mean, it was just brutal. I get to 150 and I'm thinking, holy crap, I'm never going to make it to 160. She's going to have some crappy data. I got to get her good data. So I keep going. And when I got to 158, I'm thinking, man, I am just two, two beats per minute away from the goal. Folks, it took so long to get from 158 to 159. It showed up at 159, and I thought to myself, I just can't go any further. If I go to 160, they'll have plenty of data to determine how I died on the treadmill. That's not going to help me any, so I stopped. And then I started thinking about all my friends that own businesses. There's a lot of stress with business owners right now. They're going through a stress test. And some of those business owners, they're stressing out because they're trying to deliver the past to the future. They're trying to deliver the way they did pre-virus in a post-virus world. Market realities changed for a lot of organizations, for a lot of industries. And then there's those that are stressing out, and I call it a temporary stress because they're trying to improve. And when you're trying to improve, when you're trying to deliver the future to the present, well, guess what? Stress is replaced with enthusiasm, with passion. It's not stressful. It's not stressful to be on a quest for improvement. It's fun. You get to use your imagination. When you're trying to drag the past to the future, it's not fun. It's stressful. You're using your memories to create your vision. And everybody knows, everybody knows that you cannot, you cannot deliver yesterday to tomorrow and those that try will always be stressed. So if you really want to pass the stress test, if you really want to pass the stress test and you're a business owner, guess what? Replace it with enthusiasm, with enthusiasm, and set out on a quest of improvement. Because we all know this, my friends, status quo is the killer of all that will be invented. Don't get stuck in status quo, and I'll see you all on Monday.